the Kaduna Islamic based faith organization Jamatu Nasaril Islam, JNI, has drawn their full support for the presidential candidate of the PDP, Atiku Abubakar, and the Kaduna state governorship candidate, Isa Ashiru. The religious group said Nigerians need a government of inclusion. Our correspondent, Habila Durofai's report, is presented from our studios. The political game of 2023 is gradually changing as various groups continue to endorse one political party and candidates to the other. The Islamic Sheikh Hali Rumaraya says the current administration has filled Nigerians with a high economic rate that has put over 33 million citizens into abject poverty. The electorate relation to the forthcoming general elections is for them to make sure that they cast their vote for the PDP's candidate from top to bottom. Because during their time, we recorded a lot of successes in terms of security, also in terms of social welfare. Today, in the APC's government, from the inception of the APC's government to just October 15 this year, 2022, we lost at least 53,418 Nigerians. This is very mind-boggling. PDP governorship candidate in Kaduna State, Isa Ashiru, said he would run an open government to all residents. He said al schools will be prioritized in order to reduce street hawking and begging. I have uh, made uh, several requests, uh, in particular the issue of these uh, uh, Islamic uh, schools and with the al system. And uh, we'll, we have uh, discussed extensively and agreed that uh, we'll uh, have to make uh, a provision, adequate provision to cater for the Alamajaris. Saeed Haruno is the Director General of the Kaduna State Campaign Organization. He reaffirmed his support for the duo, saying that their competency will improve the economic problems and address security challenges but definitely in Nigeria. And we believe that uh, the electorates, and in particular, the, the religious organization have seen the, the, the wisdom in believing in us and we believe they will give us the support to win the election. However, a renowned Islamic cleric, Sheikh Yusuf Riga Chikun, said if insecurity is tackled, it will address the issue of unemployment and economic stability and education. Scholars, we are together with them today. We meet at here because we have the many problems in, in this state. Agenda is very important because we need the security, we need the education, we need the agriculture, everything we need. It. That, is, that is why this five uh, point agenda is very important to Kaduna State Fearful. They insisted that Nigerians need a leader who has respect for the rule of law, one that is fair and just to all, irrespective of backgrounds. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.